Hi, welcome to Seymour's World Commentary. What's the thread that ties us together? Is it common decency and kindness, or hatred and divisiveness? How do we connect to accomplish greater things? Over the past couple of years, through my own inner growth and through connecting with many others, I've come to realize that there's not one common thread that ties us together. As you probably know by now, I'm a very positive, motivated person and believe that we are destined to live lives intertwined by love, work, play, and possibly divine intervention. Forget about making New Year's resolutions. They are notoriously hard to keep. Instead, set out on a concrete path to make the next chapter of your life more meaningful and satisfying. How? Begin by finding the thread that ties your story together. Intuitively, you know that the stronger the role you can play in your life options, the greater the chance you will be productive and happy with them. Finding a way to use your multiple interests and talents in a coherent whole enables you to grow your unique and valuable mastery. That's the key to living the elusive, flourishing life you seek. Your body of work is everything you create, contribute, affect, and impact. It is the personal legacy you leave at the end of your life, including the tangible things you have created. Individuals who structure their careers around autonomy, mastery, and purpose will have a powerful body of work. Find your strongest asset as you identify your most valuable assets such as skills, strengths, experiences, identity, and knowledge, then become comfortable with the interweaving of all your strengths. With your quilt as your true path, you are more likely to be pulled into a personal and a work life that integrates more of them. A complementary way to identify them is to recognize your strongest moments, which then become your strongest assets. I suggest you look for the serendipitous moments when things gel in your life using those assets. I also advocate you create a hook on which potential friends, family, and allies can hang their support. So how does this make a thread that ties us together? Because if we all recognize the want and the need to share our assets, the world will become a better place, one that respects each other for our strengths and assets rather than our weaknesses. A simple suggestion, do one act of kindness for someone else and watch the ripple effect you have created. Thank you for watching Seymour's World Commentary on ThinkTech Hawaii. I'd love to hear your comments. Aloha.